Namaste. So here we are in Sri Lanka. Everything's very peaceful. And I am dropping, uh, making any more big video series uh, because after more than 10 years, there really hasn't been any appropriate response. What I consider appropriate response is uh, someone with whom I can have a conversation on my level. And another form of appropriate response would be if someone is not on my level, they can come here and study with me. There's plenty of accommodation. They can rent a room down the street. They can come visit every day like that. But nobody has come. Even I was in Tiruvannamalai five years posting videos about Ramana Maharshi and about Advaita. Nobody came. Um, a few people, spiritual tourists, came. <laughs> and they just wanted my, my blessings. Huh? Well, what good are my blessings? If you don't know and you're not doing the sadhana, then what good is my blessings going to do? Huh? Just like, have a nice day, you know? <laughs> it's so silly. People think you can go to some wise man and he's going to zap them and they get enlightened. It doesn't work that way. You have to prepare yourself. You have to do the sadhana. You have to have the knowledge. So, after 10 years, 12 years now, it's enough. It's enough. So, I'm taking all the videos, all the series, going all the way back to, what, uh, 2011, and packaging them, the narrations, the transcriptions, the graphics, everything, and publishing as PDFs, and giving these to the AI. The AI scans them, learns them, summarizes and categorizes all the information. And then you can ask a question and it will respond. Maybe not with the same level of detail as in our original videos, but it will respond very intelligently. I'm actually very impressed by this thing. <laughs> This uh, GPT 3.5 or whatever it is. Now GPT 4 is out. Uh, but anyway, we are using uh, AI called Cody. And we're rebranding it to Noli Genie AI. So this Noli Genie has all of our books and the transcriptions of our videos. And it's not complete. We're still working on it. There's so many videos, you know, it's just overwhelming. Close to 1,500 videos in well over 100 series. So we're gradually adding the uh, materials to the bot and the different topics are listed. If you go to our page, gno.com, Lee. You can find right on the front page, if you scroll down a little bit, the Noli Genie AI bot. And you can ask it questions, any questions relating to the topics listed above it, or to any of our videos, but especially the topics listed because they are the ones we have completed and fed into the bot. So you have to be proactive in spiritual life. The word Upanishad, Upanishad, means come close, sit down, and then there is a, a conversation. Not just listening, also asking questions, queries, inquiries, and what does that mean? You're exposing your doubts. You're exposing your ignorance. You're exposing your lack of realization. And asking the teacher or the guru, 
How can I understand this? How can I realize it? This has to happen. This is called the ontic conversation. The ontic conversation is a conversation with the friend, the one who is calling you to enlightenment, to spiritual life, to authentic living, to integrity, and asking all the questions, all the queries that you have in order to clear them up. Without this question and answer dialogue, the spiritual teaching will not bear fruit. So you have to go through this. This is the meaning of the word Upanishad, Upanishad. That you come close, sit down, and begin this conversation, this dialogue. And there are many examples in the Upanishads of these dialogues between student and teacher. So you should study them, and you should also study our videos, which are uh, purports or summary studies on the scriptures, and also giving the links between the different scriptures and among the different views in the scriptures, according to our system of four states of consciousness, four views, and four yogas. So that's something we've been over a bunch of times. So if you want to study our knowledge, if you want to realize this enlightenment, you should download the Noli video guide. I've got a link in the video description here. And you should then uh, see the topics that are explained in the different series and the method of organization, which is based on the four states of consciousness. This teaching is coming from Shankaracharya. It's not something I made up. Okay. So uh, then you can go to the No Lee site and interact with the genie AI. Ask your questions, and you'll get summary answers. Now, for now, it's just giving the answers, but in the future, a near future, I hope, uh, we're going to enhance the bot to also give links to the uh, source materials it uses to answer those questions, to generate those answers. GPT means generative. Uh, genitive transformation. So what we're doing is making all our materials available. And when the bot is enhanced, which should happen in a couple of weeks or so, you'll be able to click on the citations and actually view and download the original documents linked to the original videos and the video series that the uh, answer is coming from. This is very exciting because <laughs> it relieves me of the work of having to answer so many questions. I mean, I got to the point where I just couldn't do it anymore. And when people would write me emails, I'm saying, sorry, I can't take on individual uh, question and answers unless you become a disciple. You know? Come here and become a disciple, but people don't want to do that. So, you know, I'm not, I don't have the time and energy. I have my own life to lead. So, if you want to understand, like uh, some of the uh, viewers giving appreciations in the comments to our last video, they're saying this knowledge is uh, the highest I've ever found, it's transformative. It helped me overcome so many obstacles in my spiritual life and so on. So there are people out there who are appreciating this knowledge. But the lack of a way to make inquiries is a serious obstacle. No two students, no two disciples, no two sadhana, sadhakas are the same. Each one requires different knowledge, different techniques to break through their individual particular obstacles to enlightenment. So there has to be a way to inquire 
and get details from the teaching as to your specific problems in spiritual life and how to overcome them. Now, of course, most of our so-called problems are self-manufactured, self-created, and they are due to a narrow range of knowledge, a narrow ontology. We call it ontological constraints. Your ontology, your being, huh? your way of being, and the scope of your being is constrained. It's narrowed. It's uh, fenced in huh? by these barriers called ontological constrictions. So because of that, you can't be all that you need to be to realize this teaching. Well, we had an incident recently where one fellow came all the way from New York. And then when he was, even though I told him everything, right? <laughs> what to expect. When he actually was confronted with the nature of the radical tantric practices, he couldn't handle it. Yet he ran off. So I don't know if anybody is ever going to get this. <laughs> but it's interesting. On Sunday, we have a video team from Harvard University. And they're coming out, they're doing research. And I'm not sure exactly what they expect me to do. <laughs> Other than sit here and talk like I always do. Um, but I'm going to receive them and let them video maybe some Shiva Puja or me doing some of yoga practices or whatever they want to see. And yeah, maybe that'll help things. Maybe it'll add a little credibility to our uh, presentation here. Because as one of our viewers commented, I see so many other video teachers with many, many more followers than you, but the quality of their teaching is nowhere near yours. And I replied, well, I see an inverse relationship between the quality and the number of the followers or viewers that uh, the higher the quality, the less people are going to understand it. And we've always had the vision of a postgraduate level spiritual course. And that was the original intention. And we have followed up on that and maintained a very high standard of intellectual rigor and spiritual purity of understanding direct from the original scriptures. Nothing that we say here is speculation. Nothing is invention or fabrication. It's all directly derived from the original scriptures and from my personal experience in practicing and realizing them. So that was my principle right from the beginning. Graduate level material based on direct experience. And if I haven't experienced it, I'm not going to talk about it. If I haven't realized it, it's off the table. <laughs> That's the principles on which this channel is based. So you can reap the benefit of those by simply visiting our site, no.ly, and using the bot to inquire and ask any questions your heart desires. And hopefully, <laughs> I want to get some feedback on this, so let me know if this helps you overcome the obstacles to attaining full enlightenment. Aum Namah Shibaya.